The separation process starts when the truck arrives at the MRF. The exact process varies at each MRF, but each efficiently separates recycled materials so they can economically be remade into new products. In this case, the materials are first carried along a conveyor belt to a V-screen separator. The V-screen is made up of a series of fast-moving rotators that separate out the newspaper, cardboard, and other paper items, allowing metal, plastic, and glass to fall through to the next belt. Once separated, the paper is bundled and prepared for reprocessing. The remaining materials carry on toward a two-stage metal recovery system. First, a series of super, heavy-duty magnets attract items made of ferrous metals, such as iron, tin, and steel, away from the belt and into an area where they can be packaged for a metal mill or smelter. Since aluminum isn't magnetic, it continues along with the other items toward an eddy current rotor. Eddy currents create strong fields of energy around non-magnetic metals, causing the aluminum objects to shoot away from the rotor and into a collection area for bundling. Plastic and glass items continue on the belt to an optical scanning system that recognizes the plastic items and moves them away with directed blasts of air. The plastic materials are blown off of the belt, leaving the heavier glass to continue on. Now at the end of the conveyor belt, the glass falls into a final container, completing the separation process. You've just seen how a mix of recycled materials gets tidied up with little human interaction, but that's just the beginning. Using the navigation above, select the destination you're interested in visiting next. Or sit back, relax, and travel alongside the recycled paper to a mill, where you will learn how it will become new paper products. At any time, you can travel to and from any of the destinations. So what are you waiting for? Get going!